Hello and welcome to your Buckeye High School November Student of the Month program. I'm Mike Kovac, the coordinator for the Medina Countywide Kiwanis Student of the Month uh, program. And with me today is Anessa Rogers, your Buckeye High School uh, November Student of the Month. Congratulations, Anessa. Thank you. And Anessa is a junior also. That's two juniors here uh, for the, the females at Buckeye High School to start the year. You're fifth out of your class. Congratulations. That's outstanding. And... Um, uh, again, as a junior, you've been involved with a lot of activities and such uh, at Buckeye High School, in and out of school. What has been some of your favorites so far that you've uh, been involved with? I really like Huddle. Uh, Huddle's a program where you go down to the elementary school and teach kids about decision making and drugs and alcohol. And this is my third year, so I'm kind of, I'm kind of a veteran, and I, I really think that's fun. I really enjoy doing that. Outstanding. And again, as a junior, you've only had three years worth of classes, but what have you found to be your, your most difficult class at Buckeye High School so far? Um, definitely my math class yeah, last year was very difficult in chemistry, in AP Euro. <laughs> <laughs> Lots a lot of, of hard things. classes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what was your math class last year? Was it algebra? Um, was... Yeah, it's algebra two. Okay. I, it was hard. <laughs> <laughs> Always a difficult class. How about on the other side, what's been your most enjoyable class that you've had so um, far? I've always, I've always loved Spanish class, mm -hmm. and I really enjoyed my English class last year. I became a much better writer. Okay. And uh, speaking of the, the Spanish class, you did a short-term exchange, uh, student exchange program, kind of related to that also. You yeah. Tell me a little bit about what happened there. I went to Argentina for two months over the summer, and... That, that was an experience. My Spanish got a lot better. I met a lot of cool people. I learned a lot about Argentine culture. And my, my grandmother's actually from there, so it kind of brought it all home. So that was, that was a lot of fun. And how did, you, how did you find that program? What was that? Uh... Um, I went through Rotary Club, mm -hmm. and they have a very good program. And there were a lot of other exchange students there as well, so I could connect with other people. So... Okay, Rotary. Rotary, even though it's not Kiwanis, also has a very good program, <laughs> but uh, yeah. So, uh, you've also been involved with the Academic Challenge Team. Uh, you want to tell me a little bit about that, what's involved uh, with the Academic um, Challenge Team? We, we meet uh, twice a week, and, and then we go to, to several different meets throughout the year. Um, it's, it's fun. It's different. Um, I'm not necessarily the best member on the team, but I, I do like going. And whenever you get that answer right, you're like, yes. I knew that. I knew that. Outstanding. And have you been with that all three years here? At Park uh, Park? Yeah, and also in uh, seventh and eighth grade. Wow. Okay. I didn't realize they even did that in the junior yeah. high level. That's terrific. And you've also been involved with uh, the theater club here at uh, Buckeye High School. Why don't yeah. you tell me a little bit about uh, my what's sophomore going on there? year? No, actually, my, my freshman year, I kind of got one of the major leads, which was a lot of fun, and. That was that was a bye bye birdie, and then in and then in my sophomore year, I also got a lead, and that I mean, the, theater is definitely a lot of fun. Getting up there on stage, just becoming a character. <laughs> a lot of people wouldn't think of it that way, but I'm glad <laughs> that you enjoy. Uh, <laughs> a lot of people would say that's their greatest fear, yeah. but uh, that's outstanding that you're able to do that and enjoy it. Uh, one of your nominations for the Student of the Month, month program came from uh, Mrs. Nusky, and which, uh, what class did she teach for? Uh, Spanish too. Ah, okay. And she has some nice things to say about you here. There are so many words that can describe Anessa, but the ones that come to mind first are leader, intelligent, motivated, curious, and kind-hearted. On a daily basis, Anessa challenges herself to learn as much as possible and help others around her stay on task and put effort forth in class. Anessa not only studies and gives a, goes above and beyond on assignments, but she stays involved in numerous school organizations and activities that have helped shape an amazing young lady. So that's a, that's a wonderful uh, recommendation for you, and uh, it served you well for the Student of the Month uh, competition. Now, again, you're only a junior, but do you have any idea what you think you might like to do once you uh, go beyond Buckeye High School? Yes. <laughs> I, love, I love thinking about my future. <laughs> I, want, I want to go to... Um, uh, Brigham Young University, uh, majorly LDS college, and uh, there's a lot, I haven't decided what exactly I want to study, but either like political science or psychology or law or business, and I want to study a few more languages to add to Spanish, and I, 
I want to go to the FBI, or I might want to do something in politics. I don't really know. I tried to figure that out. <laughs> oh, you've got some time there, but that's great to be excited about your future. You should be. You've got some outstanding accomplishments so far. Um, now, again, you're, you're a junior here. You're going to be a senior next year. Do you have any advice that you think you might want to give to, to fellow students coming into Buckeye or the freshmen moving up? Yeah. Uh, Buckeye High School is really a good place, and high school is a pivotal point where you can really get involved and do a lot. And I just say you have to work hard in school, and you have to connect with your teachers. And the teachers are really fun, and you can, you can really do a lot at Buckeye. Outstanding. And again, our November Female Student of the Month at Buckeye High School, Anessa Rogers, daughter of Debbie and Chuck Polidari, fifth out of her class of 155, and congratulations to you again, Anessa. Thank you.